Hi guys, it's Lisa's Finding the Redo. I'm a 57 year old retired school teacher who needed to find her redo. And I found that redo by reselling used clothing, shoes, and hard goods. Today, we're here for a mystery box unboxing. A thread up mystery box unboxing. And it's a thread up fun box. Y'all know I love fun boxes. Probably like them as much as I do the designer boxes. It's fun. So if you haven't bought a fun box, I suggest you doing it. They really are fun. And I have gotten something that I can sell to make the profit for it. And then I keep several items. Um, apparently, my new handsome fella wanted to be in the video. His name is Bo. And we adopted him last week. My daughter works at a um, uh, animal control place in, in uh Conway, which is about 30 miles from us, and he came in on a surrender, an older couple, the woman had dementia and just didn't want the man to leave to walk him, and it was in the city where he couldn't get out and just play, so I'm going to put him down, but his name is Bo, and he's a very handsome Cheweenie. <laughs> okay, Bo, you got to stay down, okay? Okay, let's get busy opening I did open the box. I haven't looked inside of it because I didn't want to see what it was. And it is indeed a thread up fun box. And it cost me, let's see, $28 plus $5 shipping, $4.99 shipping plus tax. So let's get, I love fun. Did I tell you I love fun boxes? And I love getting free packing pillows because I use them. Okay, so. They do have things. Oh, I needed to tell you where I got this. Okay, some cool things that I've gotten, so I want to be sure and look at this. But this did come from, as most of my stuff does, Sewanee, Georgia. Okay, so let's get started. First thing is a, like a credit card holder. I don't see a brand or anything on it. It's in great condition, but there's not a brand, so I don't know if it's even sellable. Okay. This is a cute little uh, keychain. Now, I may take this off and keep it because I need a nice keychain. Um, just, or I need a keychain, maybe not even a nice one. But this is cute. It's cute. Then again, I may save it and gift it for Christmas. Okay, this is a Savarsky. How do you say that? Can you see the, yeah. Okay, and it is a wallet, okay. I kind of like this wallet. It's pretty cool. It's nice. It looks new. Uh, there's some scratches on the outside, uh, but it hasn't been used because, I mean, in really good shape. And by the way, if I'm planning on selling it, I'll be putting the uh, comps right there. Okay? So let's see what else in this goes just happened to fall out. Okay. Well, I'm having difficulty. Y'all know I have difficulty with unwrapping, don't you? Okay, so let's start off with the item that is wrapped. <laughs> wow, I got one of these last week, or last time, a couple weeks ago when I got one. Oh, throw it up. But it was an extra last time, so maybe it's an extra again. Okay, a nice Vera Bradley... Uh, looks like, yeah, a lunch bag. It still has the um, um, info in it. It's never been used. Here with school starting back, that might be a perfect little um, lunch bag. Okay, the next thing is a pretty scarf. It says made in China. Who knows? Let's see. Oh, it feels nice. Let's see if it's got any kind of branding other than Made in China. Oh, that's pretty. No branding. Kind of irregular. I was sending scarves with um, large EJ, eBay purchases or even me mediocre Poshmark uh, purchases. Uh, but I had a lady kind of diss me on that and gave me two stars I think on my product even though she said she loved it but because I was she was a minimalist minimalist she didn't like it so I quit doing that because there might be other minimalists out there. Okay my next thing we'll just pull this out is a lock 
Oh, it's a Beer Bradley luggage lock. I don't know if there's even any call for that. I don't know. I like Beer Bradley and I generally sell it, so I'm, I'm happy. I mean, I'm gonna list that, that um, lunch thing is new without tags. Okay, bras. Ooh, a nice summer bra. Okay, some is a nice brand, generally sold at Dillard's. Uh, that's what we have around here. It, it, it tells you, I love when you get something new with tags and it tells you what it is. And this was $60 new. So yep, yeah, I'll take that. Okay, this is a headband that's cute as can be, but I don't see any, I mean, it kind of reminds me of a Vera Bradley, but Right now, I'm not seeing anything, but I have some um, headbands that I've put back from previous fun boxes, and I'll just lump them all together. I mean, they're cute. Nothing wrong with them. Okay, this is a pair of Stance socks. Okay, these are youth. Let's see, what size are they? Girls collection. I don't know anybody that's size. Well, I do have, um, I do know somebody. So, unless they're just worth a lot, I'll probably give them to Kylie, okay? And this is a pair of knee-high compression socks from Nicole Miller, and they're good size. Uh, I don't wear much dress clothes anymore, but uh, I don't know. I'll see what they're worth. They did sell for, they were marked down to $3, but I'll check and see what they're worth. Okay, and I got another pair of gloves. Same gloves I got last time. The good thing is, I have a multi-listing, so I can miss both of them. I believe they're the same ones of page one. I've never heard of them. They're made in China. I don't know. So, that was it. Let's count it out. The gloves, the scarf, the socks, the bra, so how many are we at? I said let's count it out and then I quit counting. That's four. The lock, five. The Brewer Bradley bag, six. The socks, seven. The uh, Svarsky um, wallet, eight. The little um, card holder, nine. Oh, let's see. It is Secura. I'm just now seeing that. Secura. I don't know. I'll check. Is that nine? I think nine. 10 and 11. So it was again, another freebie. Of course they do say they're gonna give you uh, 10 to 12, but usually 10 is what I get. Um, I'll throw this in with a jewelry thing. It says it's a room essentials tray. So I'll put it with some jewelry whenever I have his jewelry sale and, and put it in there. How you think I did? It wasn't the best fun box I've ever had, I have to admit to that, but the Soma Bra and the Beer Bradley Lunch Tote will, should make me back my money. And then the other things, I'll just have to run comps and see. I'm pleased, I'm always pleased with the fun box because I've never lost money on a fun box. And as you saw, I picked up two or three things that I'm gonna give for gifts. So. If you like this video, hit the like button. If you want to see more mystery box unboxings, I have a lot. I've been doing Goodwill, but I happened to get this one oh, a couple weeks ago. And so I, I wanted to do this one right now because um, I love the fun boxes. So check out my thrifted shirt. Home is Arkansas. I always wear a thrifted shirt on the videos and it, because it's just fun. I forgot about the headband. So that's actually 11 plus the tray. So thank you for coming. And I need you to do me one favor. I need you to go out and find your redo.